Center Health. Well, good morning, everybody. Meteorologist Dana Money here. We do have some patchy fog throughout the region this morning. You may just want to give yourself a couple extra minutes if you are on the roads this morning. Otherwise, we're starting off rather cool as we look throughout the area. Many of us in the 40s and 50s throughout the region, and we will be getting a little warmer over the next few days, returning back to those normal temperatures for this time of year. Otherwise, looking on Doppler Max right now, we do have that southerly wind right now. And we do have that mainly clean sweep across the area right now. So it's going to be a rather pleasant morning, just a little bit cool. And once again, keep an eye out for some of that fog. As some of those visibilities, we are less than a mile here at the Bowling Green Airport and other areas across the viewing area. Once again, could be visibility low for this morning. Now looking at Glasgow at 50 degrees for this morning, it looks like visibility isn't too bad in that region right now. Edmonton also sitting at 54 for right now. Not seeing too much fog right now, but over in Burksville, they're sitting at 54, seeing quite a bit of fog over there for this morning. So once again, just take it easy on the roads, especially if you do have a commute this morning, as we are seeing just some areas of fog this morning. Now temperatures this morning, a little bit chilly across the area, 49 in Greenville, 46 in Elizabethtown. We are at 51 here in town, so it just really depends, but definitely gonna want the sweater or the jacket as you're heading out this morning because it is quite a bit chilly in. We're gonna see that start to autumn in just four days from now, so it's gonna start to feel just a little bit chillier and nicer as we go over the next couple of days, but definitely feeling nicer as we go over the next couple of days. But as we look into today, we're gonna see that high up near 80 degrees. It's gonna be nice and sunny, no chances for rain. As you can see, we're starting off cool as we head into 7 a.m. And as we head towards later in the afternoon, we're going to be much warmer near that 80 degree mark as we head towards 3 p.m. So it's going to be nice by the time we get into the afternoon. If you're looking to get your car washed over the next three days, it's going to look pretty nice as the next few days. We're going to be warm and dry speaking as we head even into parts of Thursday with those highs heading up into the middle 80s. Looking into future max right now, we're going to stay dry with some of those clouds starting to move in as we head towards parts of your Wednesday. Otherwise, it's going to be nice to get outside over the next few days. As you can see, we're going to start to get just a little bit warmer before those clouds start to build in as we head into parts of Thursday. As you can see, our last day of summer on Friday still looking warm as autumn begins on Saturday. We'll start to see those rain chances start to build in as we head into parts of your weekend. Not looking like a total washout, but still something to keep an eye on for our temperatures drop back into the 80 degree mark as we head into parts of next week. So just keep the umbrella on you as we head into parts of next weekend, but looks like we'll have a lot of nice days to get outside over the next week.